Well, great morning, everyone. Let's see what we have this morning. Oh, my goodness. I don't know how many of you caught Trump's speech yesterday, but I guess they just did everything to impress him. Stay on topic. Do not go. Now, I don't know. He looked like he had a lot more clarity than he usually does. So I don't know whether they they got him not to take his Adderall or whatever he's been doing. Or they got him on some medication or what happened. Um, but it seemed like he was able to actually, he actually got through and was able to read it. Uh so uh, who knows what's going on with that. But um, that was interesting. But then he, but then he uh, was promising everything under the sun. And everybody is so much better off since he got into office. Uh, just, you know, nonsense. Oh, we're going to fix the roads. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. And and then the people he had there. And when he gave the highest medal of honor to Rush Limbaugh, I thought I was going to throw up. Thought I was going to throw up. He is the nastiest, you know, denier of Columbine, denier of the moon landing. I mean, just... The nastiest things he said about Clinton, I mean, he's horrible, horrible. And to give him the highest medal of honor, that was just absolutely beyond. Okay, so what do we have this morning? Okay, well, it's a pretty uh, simple message here. Let me see if I can grab one more card just to see. Very simple message here this morning. Let me grab one more here and see. <laughs> I need some more room here. Uh, let's do one more card. Let's do one more card. But I mean, he promised everything under the sun other than, than uh, planting a money tree in our backyard. Just all bluster and nonsense and how fabulous, of course, how fabulous he is. He held off going after the Democrats until today. Now, today, as soon as they, they you know, acquit him they're not going to take him out of office then then we'll watch him with the meltdown okay okay six of pentacles okay so this is the reading we've got today is six of pentacles gratitude you know um having gratitude again for what the universe is giving us sharing with us um having gratitude uh being contented blissful if you have more gratitude for things and live from sacredness okay then you will have more bliss within your life. Very simple message today. Be grateful for what you have. Okay. Know that, you know, blessings come from, from the universe, from that divine is. Okay. So again, have gratitude. If you have gratitude for, for what's here, 
like gratitude this morning. I woke up and we've got some light dusting of snow last evening. So I have gratitude to see that. It is so pretty in the tree over here, that little dusting of snow. And if you have gratitude, that opens you up for more happiness. What are you barking at? What? 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 What do you want? What do you want, troublemaker? What do you want? What? You just want trouble? Want to cause trouble? Is that it? Oh, I see. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. So, <laughs> this is short and sweet this morning. The more of gratitude that you have, the more doors will open for you to have more. And again, living your life with sacredness, you know, again, see the, the beauty of what is around you, out of simplicity, you know, wholeness that you're whole within and uh, then you will have more bliss more contentedness in your life and if you are more happy and you have more bliss more contentedness within your life rather than bitching and moaning and grousing and and you why me and you know all of this nonsense more doors will open if you're in a situation that's not great, then leave the situation. Don't stay there and grouse. Make some changes. <clears throat> we have free will to make changes. Yes, I understand that sometimes it's difficult to make a change, but be willing to step out and trust the universe to begin to open doors for you. And it will be much, much better. Again, let's look for the blessings that we have rather than the things that we don't have. Like, I'm very happy to be in here. Of course, I would love to be in a house. I would love to get my house sold and to get in another house. But I'm really grateful that I have this. I'm really, really grateful I have my little fireplace there that kept me warm in 25 degree weather last night. <laughs> <laughs> so again you know have gratitude and you will be a much more content person okay so thanks for tuning in and uh we'll see what happens this is one of my new cards this card is really interesting it's a, a linen thing it's got a nice slide to it uh when you go to shuffle cardstock's a little thin but uh, th this is an interesting one. This is one of the new ones I got. I have three more coming today. They should be delivered today. So um, we'll see what we have with the new cards. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. I got to go take care of something over here. Raj is bitching me out over here to go take care of something. So I better go do that right away because we know Raj. Raj means the king. His name was Raj Kumar, and he goes, Prince my butt, I'm the king. <laughs> Drop the Kumar thing, okay? <laughs> so now he's just Raj. He's, he's the king. And, I mean, he takes that seriously, okay? <laughs> he's, who, me? <laughs> So anyway, here, okay, okay, Max, okay, come here, come here, troublemaker. Anyway, I'm going to go take care of that, and I'll see you online. Thanks for tuning in. Aho.